but the reason people say it's expensive is because of the resale market. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay, I guess. <sighs> Reselling. Dude, isn't there a market for, like, counterfeit fucking all that stuff? I think we'll do Alawi GP. Alawi GP. Alawi GP. I'm okay. I gotta relearn GP anyways. I I haven't played this game enough lately. I'm pretty rusty. You mean China? Well, isn't it from, like, India as well, though? Like, I've seen a lot of videos if you go to India or anywhere... But I think it's predominantly in China and India where you get, like, counterfeit, like, Gucci or something. I work retail and I had a man tell me he could buy half the store I worked in and then he kept talking. Oh, that's great. But the question is... I had is a kid at my happy? GW store who bought his friend's models from the work he did doing commercials. He was FOMO but reversed. I had a kid at my GW store who bought his friend's models from the work he did doing commercials. Wait, what? He was FOMO but reversed? What does that even mean? Sorry, my brain is slow. I, wo I woke up recently. I don't know what the hell you just said, man. Sorry, my brain is really slow today. He bought stuff for his friends so they could play with him. Oh, that's cool. I thought about doing that for one of my buddies that I grew up with who did Warhammer when I played Warhammer with him back in the day, but now he works full-time and he doesn't want to do do that. No, no. It was a, a, like a, a guy I grew up with who he used to live with, one of the brothers. One of the brothers. Sheesh, one of the brothers. Brothers Palon. Going out on the tractor. Oh my god, I misclicked. Well, that's just terrible. I don't think there could have been an any worse misclick than that. I think that's actually the worst start in the game. Like, it's... It's it's actually just bad. <laughs> Unless I get 5-man level 1, I think this is bad. Well, I should use my hotkeys. Did you already finish painting them? Yeah. And gluing them? Well, I'm proud of you, baby. Let me see. You painted three? Yeah. Oh. Well, yeah, these look good. You're very talented. Yeah, they look exactly the same, eh? Mm -hmm. Yeah, good job. Here, bring them back. Just take them away. Okay. Um, yeah, I don't have rune. Uh, I don't have a level up. He's like, dude, this gangplank sucks. He's not even queuing me. What a pussy. He has no idea how to play GP. Look, see, he's Wing like I'm going to queue him. This was actually 500 IQ. Actually 500 IQ. I'm making him waste mana because he thinks I'm going to queue him. See? Mm -hmm. I knew this would happen. That's why I did it. Trust me. Oh my god. I just lost the bullet one second before that. No, please. Why? What do you gotta do? I'm still trying to chill. You're good. Just, just go. It's fine. Just go. What sandpaper are you using? Oh, that's good grit. Yeah, you're fine. Good grit. A sight for scurvy eyes. When do you take first take over grasp on GP? Bro, I just play whatever the fuck I want at this point. I don't really think about... Oh my god, that's so loud. 
I look. Okay, can you do that in the, the kitchen? That's horrible. I just do it whenever I want to do it, man. I, I don't think too much anymore about how I play the game. I just want to play it. Bullet is more fun, though. I'll tell you that. Bullet is way more fun. Grasp is very boring. You're done? Good. Oh, Diana's top. Unfortunately, he wouldn't have died. He's like 1 HP. Dude, I got Bounty Hunter. Let's go. You actually can make money off of dead bodies. Oh, he's got TP. Not good news for me. Oops. You can make money off dead bodies. I mean, out of context, that sounds terrible. But you know what I mean? Like, if he's if Cyan is dead and he's running at me in passive, I can shoot him and make money off him. That's called grave robbing. Dude, grave robbing is not... You know, back in the day, they used to put a string... Um, into the casket or whatever, and they used to have a bell on the graves because they realized that some people might actually be still alive and buried not dead or something like that. Bur buried alive, yeah. Buried not dead. Well, look, they're buried not dead. They're alive. It's the truth. Why do you hide the mini-map? Because I'm insecure and fat and ugly. What do you mean? <laughs> I don't care. Just yokes, bro. You feel me? Just yokes. I think there's a way to have fun in this game. Like, it's it's more fun now than it was before. Would you? Everyone think? pays. Probably been already asked this. Oh, nice. Thoughts on the GP buffs? I mean, they're they're only there to sell the skin. You know that, right? GP's broken. He's one of the best champs in the game. He's one of the hardest champs to pull off, but is one of the most broken. Like, they're only there to sell the skin. You know that, correct? The way people work is they're very unoriginal, uninspired, and soulless. When they see something get buffed, they instantly want to jump on it and not think twice. They're like, yeah, you know, I didn't play Gangplank at all for 10 years, but the fact that he's gaining 10 damage on his passive, I want some of that. And so they instantly buy the skin and they jump on the GP hype train. He gets nerfed and they never play him again. Right? So... I'll say that's worth. You can get money, money.
Well, the reason Yon and Yasuo get buffed is because people can't play them. Like, those characters are... Yon is really, really good. It's just people can't play Yon. It's like GP. People can't play GP, right? GP and Yon are broken as fuck, but no one can play them. No one can play them to the point where, like, the average person can pick them up and find success. Because the characters take dedication. They take a lot of work. And you might think, well, Yon? What are you talking about? Yon is kind of that character, but he's... He has, like, that... The, the Yon syndrome. The Yasuo syndrome. Where these people just always overcommit. They always just play way too aggressive, and then they fail and make the champ look bad. It's weird. You know, come to think of it, I haven't seen Yon in, like, 500 games. But then again, I haven't played 500 games recently. So... Man, remember when we used to see Yon every game? Picasso, peace, bro. No, GP is disgusting. What are you talking about? GP is broken disgusting. He takes more skill than Yon, for sure, and more finesse, do. but Get that doesn't Toby's. absolve him of his sins. GP's, like, really nasty. GP is... Peak GP is the most broken champ in the game. Yeah, GP's not fair. I, I mean, I will say that and, and not feel anything, because I love playing... I love the champion, bro. I've been here since day one. I'm the Gangplank guy. Right? The original Gangplank guy. So, I mean, even though he's broken as fuck, unfair, not fun to fight, it's like anything, man. If you like it, just play it. Right? That's all it really is. Uh, she didn't even do damage. Wait. How did he die? He just died? Wasn't he full HP? What the fuck just killed him? Well, flavor of the month is irredeemable because the players aren't playing... Like, I don't know. I always like to think that if it comes from the heart, that's the best thing, right? Except, like, heart attacks, heart disease, all that stuff. That's not good. That, if that comes from the heart, no go. But, like... If your intentions are are pure and they come from the heart and it's what you want, that's the best. Look, I make money off his dead body. See, watch. 37G. Let's go. First strike is about two something. No, GP is not only in a good spot. GP is in the best spot he's ever been in, bro. GP is in the best spot he's been in since day one release. Just saying. Day one release Gangplank was the best he's ever had it, but right now is damn near close. It's, it's pretty close. Is this guy trying to roleplay my Alawi? You've work to do! Get on it! Kick. Is this the new patch or no you whiz down our I think it's the next patch, no? Oh god, he's ulting mid. Save me, Jesus. He is serious. Oh, welcome back.
back to mid lane, I guess. Right? Shit, he's going for the tower. Fiend of Hell! Man, this beginner bot's kind of smart now. I don't know what it's doing. It's gained sentience. They must have updated the beginner bots. Oh my god, they're all flashing. Oh my god, Aatrox is here. Oh my god, they're all flashing. <laughs> what the Wait, why didn't I go over the wall on the left side? What am I doing? <laughs> why did I flash up here when I could just go here? Oops. Okay, okay, okay. Jesus Kung Fu. I'm not going to say anything about the GP buffs because they're only here to serve the company. They're only here to serve the skin. That's what they're designed for. He's getting a new skin, so they're buffing him. Like, thinking... It tells like, you the here, state of the, the game when thing. a classic super tank goes full damage and runs it down but, fairly but it successfully. Also, it also tells you the state of this company. They don't care anymore, so I don't think you should. I think you should play the game, have a good time, and that's it. Don't care too much about winning or losing, just play to play. You know why? Because when they buff a champion that's already broken, pissed here, fucking nasty cheese, and they buff him for the sake of selling skins to make money, I get it's a company, but they don't care about the competitive integrity of the game itself, which is what this game is all about. So, let's be real here, right? Let's be honest. No, thank you. I won't play the game. Respect. Any League haters, I respect. You know, I used to think people who hate League just suck at the game, but now I realize that's just not true. And even if it is true, which I'm sure it is to some degree, it's not... <laughs> it's not like the big thing, dude. It's not... I can never support this community anymore. I'm sorry. They've just... They're just slime. They're just creatures. Not that I hate all of them, but, like, the vast majority of the players are just, like, really, really... It, it took me a while to see it, but now that I see it, I'm... I'm sad. Oh, I should have walked back. Oh, well. No, I like the game. I don't hate the game. I hate the community. And I, I I don't hate the entirety of the community because there's a lot of passionate people who aren't fucking losers. But, like, the vast majority of the league-ranked player base are fucking losers. And I will never not say that. It's true. And everyone would agree. I don't even play league anymore without full muting. And I'm so past the point of flaming anyone because I've realized it's an absolute cringy waste of time. Like, there isn't a single league game that you leave unmuted where there's not people fucking complaining about something. And I'm not saying I haven't been there because, dear God, I've been there for years. But it took me this long to realize what the fuck's the point. Can I kill you? Oh, oh I just got 13. We are both terrible. But you're worse. <laughs> Are you slimy bitch? We are both bad, but you're worse. <laughs> oh my god, not this again. Why is Zeline here too? <laughs> Bro, what is this? This fucking rat. These rats are always here. Dear god. I mean, I couldn't really run away. Uh, are you sure you want to use that glue? Okay. If the game is shit and people are horrible, what's the point of reaching Challenger? 
So it's either for me, personal achievement, or to please you. That's it. That's essentially it. That's all it really would be. I mean, also, the thing is with Challenger is it sells. Like, as a streamer, you need to realize that I need to make... I need to I need to make League of Legends the most appealing thing to you to succeed, right? Which is hard when you hate on the game as much as I do, but, like, you know, the best way to have viewers is to be a high rank and entertaining. The only thing I probably have to work on, since people think I'm entertaining, and it is subjective, is just getting a fucking high rank again. That's really it. And then you get more viewers. It is still subjective, but let's not get it twisted. People watch more streams. People watch more League of Legends if the rank is higher. Correct? That's it. It's as simple as that. You don't need to cope. You don't need to lie to yourself. That's literally just it. And you could say, oh, I don't care about rank. I'm here for you. Yeah, but you're the minority, right? Like, not many people would agree with you in the grand scheme of things. And it, it, it is still subjective, right? Like, it is really subjective. Oh my god, Jesus. Can I cue this over the wall? No. <laughs> she's dead. Dear god, see ya. Well, the thing is with ranked... Oh, look, okay. You need to see it from, like, my point of view. I'm a full-time streamer who streams once a week. Okay? That's gonna change soon. Don't worry, we're getting into the groove of streaming again. But I'm a full-time streamer. My income is streaming, right? It is unwise to think that I hate... I really don't like this Celine, though. These guys, they're pissing me away when this guy's got tommies. Okay, so... Really, all it takes is for me to just get the, the elo, and then I gain more viewers... And I become more successful. And I'm able to support myself. You know. Right? That's really what it is. Your most entertaining for me is when you try hard with music. That's fair. I respect that. That's what I used to do 24-7. I love blasting music. I don't do it for, for anything but myself, really, to be honest. I love music. I love blasting it. I lose... Okay, if we're, if we're being real here, I lose money when I don't speak. That is true. Like, if you look at it in the grand scheme of things, I lose viewers and all that stuff if I don't speak. But I still like blasting music because it's something I enjoy. Now, if I was a higher rank, blasting the music would probably not lose me money, right? What's the point of blasting music in an elo that everyone's in, but not in an elo where everyone's not in, you know? Wait, I should be... No, we'll just keep going. I mean, look, either way, to be honest, I just do what I do. If I feel it, I do it. If not, I don't do it. All I'm saying is, realistically, if I was a smart person, I'd probably just speak 24-7 and play really well 24-7, but sometimes you just don't want to. I swear down, it's the same death. <laughs> it's the same two people every time. You dare slack on my ship! Tobias Boomer, Tobias Jesus, Boomer. Chinese Robocop. Thank you, brother.
I only want a, a nutty Alawi gameplay in Challenger. See, that would be fun, though. Alawi is fun as shit. Alawi's, like, really oddly fun. As I said, it's just strange, bro. Would you play more if you got Challenger or less? I don't even know, dude. I mean, I was Challenger last season. But... I don't know. I did get Challenger last season, hardcore playing the game. Like, if I went hardcore and played the game, like properly and thought about everything I was doing, I could probably get Challenger again with GPTF. And that's... I'm not coping. There's no bullshit. Stop pretending. This happened last season, and it's on Twitter and everywhere. So I can definitely do it. It's just a lot of willpower to want to do it, right? You dare slack on my ship? That's kind of the big thing. It does... Honestly, getting Challenger takes a lot of playing and a lot of consistent playing at that. You don't, like, mess around. I would never play Alawi. I would never play anyone but GPTF. And that's kind of boring, right? But that's just my opinion. Thought about playing Alawi at a high level. I would climb with GPTF and then just lose all of it with Alawi trying to play it at a high level. That's what would happen. <laughs> that's that's basically it as to what would happen. Right? I'm not a good Alawi. I'm a good GP, good TF when I want to be, but like not the Alawi. Alawi's fun as fuck though, man. As I said, I'll tell you, brother, this shit fun as hell. Would you, for 100,000 USD, try to get Challenger with a champ you hate like Zed LeBlanc and all that nasty shit? Of course. $100,000? Come on, bro. That's not even a question. I'll do it I'll do it on GP. A hundred grand? I'll instantly try hard 50 hours a fucking day. God damn. I'll do an everyday subathon. Nonstop. Man, he's not having a good time. Jesus. $10,000? I'll get you, Challenger. Sure thing. That is no joke. That is a... A serious wager, my friend. A serious wager. Ten K for Challenger in a month? Can't do that. It would take longer than a month. I'm playing GPTF mid, bro. <laughs> it's not that easy. Serve or die. I don't care if the others like you. Kiss kiss. Rimvet, thank you, brother. Appreciate it, man. Well, dude, you know why everyone's inting on Cyan is because Babusi has 30k viewers a stream, which is it's awesome, man. I'm not ran on his parade, but everyone's like, dude, that's cool. What? Okay. Well, I'm glad I wasn't losing this game to the Diana frucking... I said frucking. The Diana running me down like 50 times with Zaleen. You dare slack on my ship! Okay, let's one-shot. Can I one-shot a map? Nico, thank you, brother. Thank you, man. Like, Katarina shitlords that fan Cat Evolved or Gamer Girl. Okay, but I mean, to be fair, everyone likes what they like. 
and I know this is not what we like. Like, come on, we don't like Katarina. We never will. No one on this stream really does either, I'm sure of it. But, like, people like what they like. You feel me? 